How's it going guys and welcome back to another episode of David's Journey Road to Glory. On the last one, the top rated comment came from Beatbox, uh, 20,000 I believe, get a carry price, 78 thumbs up. So uh, the cheapest one on the market right now that actually has a 5,900 buy now, but his start price is 5k. So I mean, I guess it's close enough. Pretty like lax here with the rules about how much we can spend when buying a player. Um, if it's close enough like that, I figure we can buy him. Also want to apologize for no episode last week. A bunch of stuff came up, so hopefully I'm going to try and get a second episode out this week to make it up for you guys. And as you can see here, I actually just subbed out Matt Murray for Kerry Price. Um, obviously it doesn't really matter who the backup is. Uh, we don't need either of this energy. Like, we already have enough for Silky Smooth, and uh, Murray has Concrete Wall if you don't have anywhere near enough for it. Um, quick refresher here on the team. Um, offense there is looking pretty stacked, I think. I mean, we have a really good offense. Like, really no weak spots. Uh, defense also very solid now. We added Carlson in the last episode. Uh, cannot wait to use him. So we jump right into a game here. We're now in Div 4. I think we're on a win streak right now with three games. Hopefully we can keep that going here. Uh, let's go find out. Alright, so here we go guys. First game with Kerry Price. Uh, he's got Marchand, Stamkos, and I think Kucherov as his first line. Uh, really hoping we can get him the win. Also curious to see how he plays. I know Bobrovsky uh, would either make an amazing save or let a softy in. Uh, it was really strange. Hopefully Price is a bit more consistent back there. Who's coming down? Nice little spin. Get in the way, get in the way. Oh, wow. Trangelo. I, don't, I think he spun there and just sniped it. I think that was Price's first ever shot, too. And he lets it in. Not good. Here we go, Marner. Use that speed. Kane's open. Oh, wow. What a save from Holpe. Up the boards to Marner. Come on. Oh, there we go. Goudreau's wide open. Are you kidding me? He saves it again. That was insane. Here we go, McDavid. Right to him. Come on, forehand, backhand. Oh. Don't actually think I ever went forehand there. I think I just held it on the backhand the entire way. Get the cycle going. We have a couple seconds of power play, or actually 45. Oh, nice try with the tip from Ovi. Oh, what a save on Ben. All over him, but we just can't get a goal. Stamkos, just a nice save on Hope from Holpe again. He's honestly just been a brick wall back there. Big face-off win. Oh, wow, what a tip. Still can't get it. A little bit of leg. Oh my god, that'd be insane. He's in. Are you kidding me? I tried to snipe. It goes like right off the top of the net. That was a nice pass too, and he stops Ovi again. I guess, you know, Holpe. He knows where Ovi shoots, but come on. Oh, nice move. Clap it. There we go. That was a sick goal too. Finally got one by him. It's taking forever. Nice pass. Carlson to Stamkos. Spin. Kucherov. Oh, wow. Oh, Stamkos actually almost hit that in, too. There we go, Suter. Nice poke, gets it back. Oh, wow, nice save on the breakaway. And it almost somehow trickled in, though. Oh, there we go, right off the point. I didn't think actually I was going to get through. Finally uh, leading this game. I think we're definitely leading, like, time attack shots by a lot. And it finally reflects on the scoreboard. And just taking a quick look at the game stats here. As you can see, shots were definitely leading, time attack. Also leading, passing percentage. So hopefully we can keep uh, this up. We're actually lagging quite a bit. I just saw we have a red bar. I'm really just hoping we don't get legged out. Honestly guys, right now this is pretty much unplayable. So I'm just hoping he doesn't score. Maybe even quits. Oh wow, we actually get a tip call there. Two and a half minutes to go. Uh, leg isn't as bad as it was before, but still not great. All right, so there we go guys. Won that game three to one. So happy. That third period's over with. I was worried the entire time we were going to leg out. And if we would have legged out after like playing through that, I would have been so upset. So 2-0 uh, -no here actually to start Division 4. We've had a better start to Div 4 than Div 5 for some reason. Maybe it was just because our Div 5 team was just so terrible. Uh, right there's a quick look at the stats. Doubled the time to attack. Actually more than higher shots and pass percentage. Three stars here. Carlson first star the goal and assist. Same goes for Marner. And then Petrangelo there with a goal as well. So here we go guys. Next game. He's actually got Eichel as his first line center. Here we go, McDavid versus Eichel. Uh, McDavid actually didn't even have a point that last game, so we want a pack that's better than the regular gold one. Going to have to uh, get him on the score sheet here. Nice pass from McDavid to Stamkos. Get up there, Kucherov. Get up there. Puts it home, one nothing. Wow, what a save from Price on Kessel, too. Wow, there we go. I didn't even think actually Healy got that one. Somehow it gets through like two or three guys. Up to nothing here. Five seconds left in the first. Sudrani here. Still has it. Come on, get in. Oh, nice save. Wow, Puck just like bounced right to him out front. Should have cleared that sooner. So 2-1 now. Still, you know, pretty comfortable lead. Right after I say that, I, I knew as soon as I said that he was going to tie it up. 
delayed penalty there. Now it's two to two. Oh man, we were controlling like the entire game. Just 30 seconds of bad play. It's terrible. Here we go, Jamie Ben. Get by Cruz. Yes, we need Sagan wide open. If he hits that, it's a goal. Sam go snipe that. There we go. Co stop corner. Got the lead back. Ovi out front. Kane. Oh, nice try. Gives it right to. Oh my gosh. I don't, I I think the deke took too long because I pressed shoot way before. Um. He actually shot it, but yeah, I think he was still doing the deke. I shouldn't have went for that one. So we got some four and four action here. Hopefully, we can make the most of it. Oh, that was close. Kane Carlson to Marner. He's trying to go right to Marner. Spin pass. Oh, he's all over Kane though. Kane Carlson <laughs> puts in the back. The net. That was actually a pretty sick pass from Kane. Four two. Bad D there by me. Left that guy wide open. So we have a 4-3 lead, but still four minutes to go. We gotta play smart here. There we go. Nice little uh, interception from Subban. I didn't think it was actually gonna get shot off. Jeez. But point two. I think it's safe to say we won this one. So there we go, guys. Back to back wins. Feels pretty good. So I think the win streak's now at five games. I could be wrong adding that up. Uh, total coin reward there is usually not too crazy still. Like 1,200 coins, not even. Yeah, 1128. Uh, but 3-0, that's pretty solid. One point away here from making sure we stay in Division 4. And we actually only need five more points to get promotion. So uh, with seven games remaining, obviously that's like two wins and an overtime loss. I think there's a pretty good chance we get that done. And here's a quick look at the stats for this game as well as the three stars. Stamp Coast, a goal and two assists. Uh, he had a great game. And I wasn't sure if McDavid got a point. He actually did have one assist, so that's good. Otherwise, we'd have had to open up the regular gold pack. So at least here, we'll get three rares. Still not great, but, you know, better than the alternative. So here we go, guys. 17FK gold plus pack. Hopefully, one of the Stanley Cup cards is in here. Also, there's some, like, World Championship cards, which is pretty cool. Let's hope for something. So here we go. Uh, arena off the start. Thomas Vanek would have wrecked a better rare than that. He needs to be, like, at least an 88, whoever we get, to use him. McKinnon is 85. Isn't too bad. I don't know if it's good enough, though. I think we have one more rare here. Sydney Crosby, that's a sick pack. Are you kidding me? Wow. 79k gold plus pack. We get Sydney Crosby and Nathan McKinnon. Two of like the best players in the league this year, both from Cole Harbor, Nova Scotia. So obviously Crosby's gonna be had to this lineup. McKinnon may or may not, but uh, that pack was definitely worth it. Also wanted to give you a quick updated look at these scoring leaders. Marner there, still our leading scorer, 24 and 21. McDavid though is you know closing the gap. Stamkos there has been playing really well for us. Same goes for John Carlson, even Kucherov, I guess. Um, how did Carlson, Eric Carlson, do in his first couple of games? Two points, two games. That's pretty good. Also want to see Price's stats. Two goals against, 89 save percentage. So, I mean, a lot better than Bobrovsky there. It's actually very, very good for Hutt. I'm also going to show you guys the team here. Trying to just figure out who we're going to take out for Sidney Crosby. Still can't believe. Like, I was pretty happy with McKinnon. And then we got Crosby in that pack. So, I mean, obviously, it's going to have to be one of the lower-rated guys. So, probably Goudreau or Hall gets taken out. Um, they're both speedy left-handed wingers. Goudreau's a bit smaller. He's got better hands. I think their speed's about the same. Shot's the same. So, um, Hall's a little bit better checking. Goudreau actually has better defense. So, it's probably going to be Hall that gets taken out. Then, where are we going to put Crosby in? I'm not sure how it's all going to work. Um, but, obviously, you're going to add him. McKinnon, though, I don't think is good enough to make this team, unfortunately. But... Hopefully you guys enjoyed that episode. If you did, leave that thumbs up. As always, guys, leave a comment. Let me know who you want me to buy next. Max 5K price. Other than that, thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Goodbye.